Welcome back to Grain Kernels. I'm Noah Andreessen, and this is brought to you by Great Lakes Grain. Today, I'd like to introduce Heather Miller. She is a grain originator over the Dutton, Brigden, and Glencoe branches. How's it going today, Heather? It's going great, Noah. How are you? Good, good. Good to have you. And Thanks. Heather, can you tell me about how you got into the grain business? So I grew up on a small fair to finish pork operation. And um, I guess for me, I was much more excited to talk to people than I was to talk to pigs. There would have been an opportunity if I would have wanted to farm, but um, I was actually more interested in the crops. And um, luckily enough, when I was in grade 12 in high school, they had just started a cooperative education program. And so I participated in that program and I was able to actually uh, do my work term um, at a grain elevator and learn about, uh, learn about the grain business. Um, it's pretty amazing today to look back and see how many years ago that was, all the things that have changed, but all the things that have stayed the same too. <laughs> now, you have a lot of expertise. Can you give me your spin on the market today and some advice you might give to the farmer? So, I mean, as we've all noticed, the market over the last eight, nine months has had a phenomenal run. Um, I've never in my career quoted $19 soybeans. I've never quoted $20 soybeans or $9 corn which is pretty amazing, um, you know, just, just to see those types of levels. Now, we have come off of those high numbers that we did see. Um, just kind of in the last week, Chicago markets have retraced a bit. But I think the thing to keep in perspective and to realize is, yes, we may not hit the peak, but there's still some really, really good prices on the table here today. And um, I think as a grower, you know, take a look. You'll have a good handle on your acres here now with planting having gone on. Um, you know, most of the corn's in the ground, it seems like, and we're working away at soybeans. So you'll know what type of acres you've got. We can put some approximate estimations on yield and, uh, you know, take a look at what percentage of, uh, of contracting you want to take a look at and see what you want to get covered off. And that'll be all for Grain Kernels today.